What's good, Ritter Nation? It's your boy Sanji back at it with a quick video. In today's video, I want to talk about this Nate Hobbs sack play, and I want to kind of just get into the design of the play uh, because a lot of good things in this play. You know, first and foremost, the thing that I noticed right off the bat is the fact that not only does Nate Hobbs blitz from the slot, but he disguises it. Like you can look at Hobbs and you can't tell that this guy's about to blitz. And the fact that he doesn't run into anybody while he's blitzing is just a nice, smooth play straight to the quarterback. And another thing I love is I love the energy after he gets the sack, man. Like Jonathan Abrams right there congratulating him. Amik Robertson. These guys are pumped up for the rookie getting his first career sack. And that's what you want from Abram, right? You want him to bring that energy. Another thing I noticed with this play is you got Kwiatkowski coming on a blitz. Without Kwiatkowski and Hobbs coming together, this play doesn't work. Because as you're going to see, Kwiatkowski gets picked up by the left tackle, which leaves Amik coming on the blind side unaccounted for but there's another part of this play that i think a lot of people don't see and it's at the top of the screen and this is what gus bradley designs right gus bradley puts this in and he wants this to happen and without this this play doesn't work because without carl nassib going to the running back and picking the running back up if geno smith is able to see it a little bit quicker if he doesn't see that carl nassib's picking up the running back he checks this off and this is a huge play in fact, a little bit later on, the Raiders ran this same play, uh, and the defensive end did not actually go out, and because of that, the quarterback was able to check it down to the running back, and the play ended up being a touchdown. So this has to be executed by every single person, and it has to be executed well. Hobbs has to come on the edge, Kukowski has to go and take that tackle, the defensive end on the opposite side has to pick his guy up. Even Jonathan Abram, Abram has to step up, and he has to step up quick enough that it makes Geno Smith think twice about quickly checking the ball to his hot route. On an overall level, this play hits. It's a great design, it's a great play and execution by all the individual players. And I'm excited for what's to come. I think Gus Bradley has done a great job from what I see from a scheme perspective. But I want to see more, and I can't wait to get all the first string guys out there. I think the Raiders defense is going to be so much better this year, just from a scheme perspective. You can already tell they're being coached, and they're being coached well. If you guys enjoy this video, hit that thumbs up button, smash that subscribe button, and make sure to subscribe if you guys are not already subscribers. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys next time with another video.